Hello YouTube, this is KSOC of 12 here. And today, let's play the guessing game. Did you guess? 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 Okay, you guys ready? No, you guys didn't finish guessing. Did you guess? Did you guess? Okay, that's yeah. I guessed. Okay. I guess you guys guessed, I guess. Guess, guess. Okay. I'm stop being annoying. Guess what? I think you guessed right. Oh, yeah. You guys guessed right. Yep. Got a new window in the Project F-150. Check that out. <laughs> brand spanking new. Well, not brand spanking new, but brand spanking new in this car. Came out of a junkyard car. Okay, now guess what I had? Haha, <laughs> I got sliding windows. And before I didn't. Okay. That's pretty much. All we did la last weekend, right now it's Wednesday, April 10th, I suspect. And I'm sorry I, got, I didn't do a video on how to replace it, but I'll tell you right now. Over here, there's a bolt. Um, that's not supposed to happen. Oops, I broke the clip. Ay, ay, ay. That's when you get too excited for something. All right, I'm gonna have to super glue that. Okay, you gotta remove this bolt. It's a torque wrench 47, size 47. Then after you remove that, you pull here, pop it out. Pop this whole thing out. Works the same side as the other side. Then you pop off this bench. You lift up and pull out. That's how you pop this chair off. This can't come off, but this can come off. Then there is, for the window, there is, I think, um, 12 view, um, 12 8 millimeter bolts with washers all around the window. Then the molding, the black part, um, has 15 8 millimeter bolts with no sock, uh, with no washers. And the window comes right off, and basically. From there, you guys have to use the window sealant. Okay, I fixed it. Use window sealant. I kind of don't have the can anymore. It finished. So, yep, you put the window sealant on. Then, after you finish with the window sealant, you have to keep water out of reach by the window. And you have to let it dry for 48 hours. Then, test it with water, see if it's still leaking. But it hasn't rained yet, so... It gives it more days to dry off. It's been three days already. So, yep. Thank you guys for watching. And uh, this is one of the boringest videos I have because um, I'm running out of topics. Because this truck is like literally almost done fixing, repairing. If you look at it from the day I first got it to now, about a month and a half later the truck turned out to be very nice and you guys are asking where's the bumper we took it off because oh because we got a new bumper for it so that's going on this weekend but first we're not going to install the bumper until see that we fixed one leak but there's another leak and it used to be the power steering we fixed that with a new power steering pump but if you look over there there's a lot of oil residue. Well, if you look at the filter on top, there's a oil oil sensor. And I suspect that the gasket is leaking. So, yep, that could be it. Um, if you guys are interested, since this is a boring vlog, I'm going to give you guys a cold start. Okay? So, um, pardon me one second. Let me go. Oh. 
this is going to be a tough one. I don't know where to put the camera. Okay. Put it right here. Let me go inside the car. And start the wagon. Be back, okay? Alright guys, thank you for watching, please subscribe and like, and more videos to come. Please give me more ideas on what to make on videos so I won't run out of videos. Now, let's do a review on my Chinese scooter. Thank you for watching, bye.